Hey guys, welcome to the Sorry Bash Replay Showcase, episode 54, with me, Jack Morris, from Man on Fire Films, where I really am struggling to think of stuff to say for this week. So this week, nothing. Next week, maybe. Our first replay for the day is Taste of the Glory by Chill It On. Let's take a look at it. Now, if I remember correctly, this is a, yeah, this is the one with that kind of as you just saw, that decap that I had um, made me expel quite a weird noise when I watched it the first time. As you guys know, I really do like rip replays, ones that are just sheer demonstrations of power, and that is certainly one of those. And also a really, really cool pause right at the end. Kind of switches his hand too, which is a nice touch. Let's see this from Jeff Cam. I have a feeling this could look pretty cool from Jeff Cam, so let's see if we can get the rip. Yeah, there we go. Oh, wow. Yes, that looks really cool from Jeff Cam. And then a really weird upward shot of Chiller done that I don't know why it's there. Let's see the rip one more time, and rip. <laughs> that's cool. That's really good. All right, one more, one more time from normal, normal cam. Because again, I love the rip replays. And honestly, I, I kind of want to slow this one down a little bit because I'm unsure. Is it the punch that gets the decap, or is it actually a rip? I, I guess I'm at the wrong angle. It is just a yeah, just a sort of rip. Just an absolute rip. That's really, really awesome. All right, back to normal speed, and let's move along to our second replay for today, which is Lays and Destroy V2 by J uh, DJ Addis D Jadis D Jadis 14. However you want to say that. And this is a great, uh, really, really great replay. Now, there's this thing that somebody tried to explain to me once. I, I think it was on a live stream. I don't remember reading it in a replay about the thing of marking things by throwing, like what he does here where he throws his hand is supposed to be marking it for a future hit. And that's cool. I like the idea of that. I mean, I don't really get, maybe, I, I suppose he is going after his own hand there. So yeah, okay. I, I, I don't know, somebody can probably explain that better than me in the comments, but if I, if I had to take a guess, which I don't, but I'm going to anyway, uh, I'd say that's a pretty cool mark. Yeah, yeah, you can yell at me in the comments for the misuse of that word, and I'm sure you all will. A uh, great replay, though. Can't take that away from it. Very, very cool replay. Um, as John would call it, the jizz blood all over the floor from his own hand uh, being dismembered, and Jeff's red blood everywhere. Very nice. Watch it through one more time and then move swiftly along. Uh, it's weird enough. I kept thinking when I was watching this through that there'd be a skeet. I it just seemed like a replay that would have a skeet, and it's kind of weird that... I, I I suppose technically it does. I guess that could be considered a skeet. But I, I mean, I feel like through trial and error, I could work out how to do that. So I don't know if that really counts as a skeet. Anyway, let's move along uh, to our next replay, which is Hayabusa Mad by Hayabusa 8. And uh, yeah, that's the Ryu costume from Ninja Gaiden. I know my extremely difficult games. What's up? Okay, right. Missed what happened there because I was too, too busy trying to think of what game Hayabusa was from. Uh, all right, we got a bifurcate kick, sort of backwards grab, and then a, I guess, heel lower heel ball of your foot kick that just demolishes Jeff. We'll probably take a look at this one in slow motion because of that kick right there. I do really like the switch hand technique he uses to get Jeff into his, uh, no, no, that was a fucked up sentence, to get Jeff into his other hand there. It's, I don't know, something about just switching hands like that, especially when it clearly leaves his first hand into his second one is just, it's really cool, it's really cool. We'll take a look at it in slow motion. Let's watch it through and see what it's like in slow motion. Cause like, I kind of want to see what happens with that kick. All right, let's see what's going on. Uh, okay, kick and love that. Just let's go both, both his hands and he. I guess, yeah, I'd say it's more of a sort of toe of his toe kick. Just a regular bog standard kick right there, I suppose. It's it's great. It's it really it really is great. It's also in the air for that pose, which is um really interesting. All right, let's move along to our something a replay for today. But I do believe I remember what the last replay was. Hell yeah, this is my first domination by Master Tron by Master Tron. And, oh wait, no, that's not Tron, that's Master Tor 3, which is actually a really creative name, Master Tor 3, instead of Master Tori. Uh, oh wait, no, I guess he, that is probably just meant to be an E, so it's Master Tori, or whatever. It's actually Master Zero R3, that's how that's said, it's numbers. Anyway, what's happening in the replay? Right, normal speed and watch it through, because I was not watching it. Oh, that's kind of like a, um, that's like a bitch slap to get his arm off, that's pretty interesting. Um, and then, is that a, yeah, it's kind of like a brutal rip. This is the, the week of brutal rips, I suppose, just ripping bits, you know, bits and pieces off bit by bit. It's pretty, pretty sweet, pretty, pretty sweet. Let's try and see what's going on here. I'm unsure what's happening with those rips because I keep getting a really shitty angle on them. Uh, yeah, it kind of rips Jeff's neck off there. I think he does sky the head, or maybe I'm imagining that. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, kind of skies. I nah, wouldn't say skies. Kind of chips the head, nips the head just a little bit. Not really a, not really a throw. Anyway, let's move along. Uh, this is Spa and Intentions by uh, V3 by Ressort K Spy. No, that's his clan tag. I'm being facetious. Sp uh, by Sparcha. And uh, forgotten about all about this replay. Okay, <laughs> how could I though? Because it's very, very, very awesome. Is, that, is there a skeet coming up? I think there's a skeet. Yeah, there's a skeet that gets a dismember, which is always very, very nice because that's quite difficult to do. All right, what's happening here? So we got a kind of, 
I guess we're- we'll slow this one down. I'm not, I'm not even gonna attempt that. Not even gonna try and talk about that one, because I clearly can't put that into words without slowing it down. Alright, so it's a punch that knocks off Jeff's leg to make him go limp. Sort of a- now this is why, where I got confused before. I guess it's a backwards kick that kind of shreds Jeff's upper body. Uh, brings his head around, follow-up kick to the neck that gets the rest of him off, and then he has that little bit of a neck stump that I believe gets skeeted with Spartio's own hand. We shall see him in a moment, and... sk 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 skeet That's awesome. That's really cool. I love seeing skeets that uh, get dismembers. We don't we see that every now and again, but it is pretty rare. <laughs> Extremely difficult to do, I, I would say. Very difficult to get a skeet that gets a dismember. All right, let's watch this through one more time and then move along. So yeah, there's another another thing for you guys who want to submit. Show me some skeets that dismembers. Moving along, this is Ascend, Pride and Joy with a sprinkle with honor. I am so surprised that name wasn't too long to actually be recognized by the game, but apparently that might be the limit. By essentiality, let's take a look. Uh, <laughs> oh, nice. That's great. Um, Again, I uh, sorted out these replays a while ago, so I've kind of forgotten what these ones were. <laughs> oh! Oh, wow! Kick skeet! That's awesome! We, we don't see a lot of that. That's a kick skeet. That's great. Alright, I want to see that, um, that punch is brilliant. Gotta see that from Jeff Cam. And, boom! Oh, wow! That's awesome. Alright, I, I know, we'll watch the rest of the replay too, but, boom! That's so cool! One more time. And, bang! That is cool. That is really, really cool. And then we have the, uh, sort of, football skeet and, Bang! Very awesome. And a nice, uh, interesting pause there. Probably wrecking his knee, but still it looks cool nonetheless. Nice pause. One more time, all the way through, this time with feeling. You know what, actually no, I've got, I've got to do it, I've got to do it. And bang! Ah, <laughs> oh, that's great. Alright, moving along, this is Don't Look At Me Like That by Safe118. Uh, this is a kind of, sort of continuous replay, just seems to keep going, if I do believe I've got the right one here, yeah. Just sort of keeps going to the last couple of frames, gets a lot of its members, looks great, nice pause at the end. Not really a lot I can add to this replay, it's just a cool one, we have a skeet, ah, skeet that gets its member too. I said it, I said it was hard to do, and now we've had two in head, and now we've had two in one show, so... Let's see if we can get a nice angle on that skeet. So Jeff's head kind of goes and bang! And it does actually, um, I like the way it sort of makes Jeff's head roll more as well, head. That's pretty cool. Um... Not a lot I can add to that with commentary, though. I do believe this replay kind of speaks for itself. So if I, you know what? Let's see the skeet from Jeff Cam. Seeing as we've had a oof, fuck, seeing as we've had a Jeff Cam heavy episode, that looks awesome. I like the mix of red and blue blood as it sort of flies away as well. I don't know. It's a it's a nice little touch. Anyway, let's move along to Laser Dodge One by Goldman Eleven. Now this mod I spotlighted last week. If you haven't seen the mod spotlight, go check it out. It's a really great mod. And I said that there'd be people in the world who are way, way, way better at it than me, and I was right. And this is evidence of that because this is cool. I, I don't know this. Um, this mod tends to kind of, sh I love the way Jess snips his head, kind of shits good replays, as long as you're really, as long as you're good at the game, it's, it, all the replays look great, I mean that just looks epic, that looks really really fantastic, I imagine using some keyframes as well, that could look even, even better, you could get some really nice angles on that, I don't know, something about it just looks um, fantastic, and I love how, I like that thing that he made Jeff make an attempt, and then Jeff just gets shredded, very very nice, I'd also like to see like a laser dodge that's just like 8 miles long, and just see how long people can go before they screw up, I reckon that could be interesting, so the creator of La laser dodge, get on it, that'd be awesome. Anyway, uh, not a lot I can really add to this replay, just, um, just an awesome one. Let's move along. This is Mert Overworked by El Morty, and uh, this is going to be our penultimate replay for today. If I've counted correctly, it should be the last but one. Now, this replay, um, this replay rings a bell, and I can't tell if I've seen it before just sort of around. I'm not trying to imply that it's stolen, but I, I might... It, it might have been on the show before. I, I'm gonna put that out there right now. Uh, this replay is ringing a lot of bells in my head. It might have been on the show before. If it is, I apologize, but nonetheless, it's a great replay. It's that. It's that downward kick that rings a massive bell. It, if it's not been on the show before, it's definitely very reminiscent of a replay that was on the show. It's cool nonetheless. I love it nonetheless, but I'm acknowledging right here, right now, this could have been on the show before. Still very cool, and we'll see it from Jeff Cam, I kind of want to see that kick, and... <laughs> that's great. That's really great. And then you get kind of a crotch shot from Jeff's point of view. That's great. I do like that kick. One more time for the kick. And but I forget, ah, bang. Very, very, very nice. All right. And our last replay for today is Acidic Ghosts by Acidic Power. And this, um, this is something very special. So I'll, I'll let this one speak for itself. Let, let's just take a look at that. Oh, that's such a good punch. Of, you know, the rest of the replay, spectacular too. That punch is phenomenal. Run into a front flip and... Oh, I just love it. I can't- I, I'm on the edge of my seat because I, I put off seeing this from Jeff Cam because I wanted it to be a surprise when I filmed this. Because clearly, I mean, clearly this replay is going to look egg- 
fucking exceptional from Jeff Kemp. So let's take a look at this. I'm really looking forward to this. Don't underwhelm me. Come on, come on, be good. And oh, wow. That is a shower of blood. That is awesome. That is really awesome. I love that front flip. There's something about that front flip that just looks really like, I don't know, quick, swift, ninja-ish. It's awesome. A really, really special replay. Pleasure to have on this show. Absolutely adore it. So, I mean, the punch, obviously the replay on its own is just great, but the front flip into that punch is just, I don't know, something special, something really, really awesome. And I love after 54 weeks, I can still think that about replays. It's just great. There's always a replay every now and again that surprises me, and this is one of those. Very, very awesome. Anyway, that's going to wrap up the show for today. If you've enjoyed this, please comment, like, subscribe, check us out on Facebook and Twitter, and go watch the Tarabash tournament that's running now. It's on the channel. I'm sure you can find a video of it. I've been Jack Morris, guys, and I shall see you next time. Goodbye. Goodbye.